everyone, today Star Stable has released all of the classic Yorvik Wild Horses, so let's go check them out. Over here at Gary Goldtooth, he has brought back all of the magical Yorvik Wilds, all of the Shire models and these three Icelandic models, and we're going to be looking at the three Icelandic models, and I might get the red one and the blue one, because I already have three Shire models in my stable, and... I've already had a chance at all these colors, and I just don't think that I need any more of them. So I will be getting this blue one, and then also the red one of the Icelandic models. So yeah, let's try to pick out some names for them. Okay, so now we're in my stable, and these are my three different wilds that I have gotten before. I have the rainbow one, which turns into like a dapple gray with white, and then the... I don't really know what this color is, it's like pink with like confetti speckles, and it turns into sort of like a Pal Palomino Appaloosa, sort of. And then I have the Halloween one. But yeah, so I have three of these, and I don't need any more shires, so... Yeah, now I have these two. This one's Water Splash, and this is Ember Flame, which I I had a sort of a hard time picking out a name for this one, but I like its name pretty well. Okay, so I'm going to do a show-off of these two horses, and I'll show their gates, and then we'll get on to the rest of the update. And also on Star Seal's website, they said that you could not change the manes on these horses, which is incorrect for these small ones. You always have been able to change them whenever they've come out. It's just that they don't look the greatest on them, in my opinion. Like, the tail looks really funny, the manes look really funny. The braids are the only thing that looks decent, and then, like, the tail looks sort of funny. But that's just my opinion. I mean, some people probably do put these on them. But then, um, also, if you have their mane changed, it will go back to this mane when they change to their wild form. But, yeah. So, there's also a, um, new item in the bonus shop for Pay One Star Riders, so we're gonna take a look at that. Um, it's sort of annoying how it doesn't come up in the, like, main page where all of the things are. So you just kinda gotta scroll through the different things and look, see what it is. So, last time we got this black saddle. And it looks like now we got this purple bridle with, well, it's a black bridle with purple highlights. And this is pretty cool, like, it will go good with the outfit. I can't wait to see, like, what the blanket looks like when that comes out. But, yeah. And that's pretty much it for the update. Star Stable sort of teased that next week there will be some new um, things that going on, like, they said traveling markets, traveling dragons, something like that, so... I am thinking that there's going to be something with Token the Dragon again, because recently this week I saw in the book where you like keep your collections that there were like, it said 52 or something out of 93, so I'm thinking they're adding more picture locations for Token, and then possibly maybe the um, traveling market that brings like 
like special clothes and stuff like that back is probably coming. And then they also said, and closets don't travel much, do they? So maybe they're making it where we can take our closet along with us so we won't have to go to our stable every time to make a new outfit. That would be pretty nice. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe for more in the future. Have an awesome day, everyone. Bye.